My name is Francisco Gabriel Garcia. I'm 28 years young, and I'm from Los Angeles, California, and I reside in Phoenix, Arizona. Los Angeles was very interesting because it's very cultural. Uh, there was a lot of art, so I was influenced by the murals and, you know, in the city. It was very beautiful to see it growing up. Um, but on the negative side of Los Angeles was that there was a lot of gang violence. So I got to see a lot of uh, drive-bys. Um, I had friends that got killed, and we saw a lot of shootings and, you know, drugs and, you know, a lot of things like that. Um, I started getting involved in graffiti. So I had, uh, I got in trouble with the law. Um, I got kicked out of four different high schools and I went to jail twice. Once for drinking and driving and the other one for, um, for tagging, for doing graffiti. Um, I was about 18 to 20 years old. And then I decided that I really wanted a change because my life was headed in a negative direction. I went to jail and I ended up going to uh, Sheriff Joe's uh, tent city. And um, I saw the treatment of the people and how they treated the people in tent city. And it was horrible. I saw rats inside the tents. We were sleeping with rats and we were sleeping in the cold. The day that I got thrown in jail in Phoenix, Arizona, this is the, probably the hottest place in the country. It snowed and the blankets the blankets were so thin, and the type of food that they gave us was horrible. And I just saw how they treated the immigrants, and they treated the immigrants really bad. Um, I believe that we need a better system, and it makes me very happy that we have laws that protect the youth, because we do need to um, help the youth, and we need to find a better way to transition them back into society and you know, for a, wetter, a better life of living. The reason why I'm so passionate about, you know, this type of work is because of my experience. And I would really encourage the system to help out the youth because they're the ones that are going to make the change in the future generations. The JJDPA can do a really great job in assisting these youth to make better choices and better decisions after being um, involved with the jail system.